if you want to know how I turned myself into black Pocahontas and I got these 30 inches for motherfucking uh, $50, then go ahead and keep on watching, y'all. I'm about to show y'all how to slay and lay. Look at that back, okay? Yeah, okay? Keep on watching. Go ahead now. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. Y'all, what it do? It's your boo, and I'm back with another review. So today we got Sensational Emery in the color Dang, girl, you going too fast. In the color uh, Flamboyage Auburn. So this is how much I cut off at the end because it was getting nappy, and the first thing is how much I plucked. So it came pre-plucked already, but y'all know I had to do a little extra. This is what the inside of the cap looked like. Yes, I did go a little crazy. Got some holes in this, a villainous cap. I was trying to show y'all the bands at the bottom, but I couldn't pick it up. Yeah, so I didn't think I was going to go that fast. But y'all know we're going to start off with the um, Ebon Lace tint, the um, medium brown. We're going to spray that thing on that thing, and we go lock it in with the ebb and hold spray the black hand so now that i got a little bit time to breathe hey y'all i missed it y'all i know this looking like a little new bathroom because it is y'all i had to move so that's why y'all ain't seen me in a minute but now we back at it so y'all see this wig at that little discoloration over there at the little edges part y'all gonna see it's gonna be a problem it's gonna become a problem sooner or later but y'all gonna see it later but yeah we all get back we all up into it we all fan that thing on out y'all know we all lock that in we all put the wig on amen we gonna put it on that's what we do that's what we do over here we put wigs on and we slay them we eat them that's what we do okay amen now watch with your eyes i'll be back later to explain everything else y'all know the first thing we gonna do when i get finished talking is cut the ear tabs off and it's gonna look crazy and crazy but we just gonna keep on going all right amen Bye bye All right, now we got our ear tabs cut out. We about to take that ebon hole spray, the black can, and we about to spray it down. Now, I like to do it in three sections just because it's easier to lay. It don't be drying fast, and then, you know, it just be sticking. So, we just going to spray that thing up on there. You're going to spray it above where your wig cap is. So, you're going to be, like, you know, right on top of it. So, it's not, like, on a wig cap, but it's on your skin, but it's, like, connecting both of them. Yeah, we going to fan that thing on out. Y'all, I'm really only shaving off a couple of seconds off of this video when I'm doing, like, the fanning part. So, you really don't even got to fan it that long before you be sticking to your finger. And to be sticking to your finger that's what it means when it's tacky it's sticking to your finger amen yeah and then you go spray another layer on top of that do the same thing fan it again stick it again and then you go put the thing on okay okay i just wanted to explain that part for y'all just in case y'all wasn't watching with your eyes correctly all right bye bye see you in a minute
All right, I'm back. So remember when I said the size was gonna be a problem? You remember, you remember when I said that. So this is when I'm noticing that it's about to be a problem. So as I'm looking at my wig, I feel like I can see my wig cap through my wig as if I like pluck too much or it's that faux lace that's on there that's kind of messed me up. And it's kind of a combination of both. I feel like the um, wig cap that I got on is kind of like that clothy material. So when like you, it get wet or it get moist when you put your spray on there, it kind of like trying to, it's trying to run away from you a little bit. So I think that's a little bit what's going on. And then that discoloration that y'all saw on the sides of the lace of the, like the edges part, I don't know why that's there, but it's both of them is working against me, but you know, we go keep it moving because you know, I can slay and I'm going to eat it. And then y'all ain't going to see it. Amen bars but yeah keep on watching with your eyes i just wanted to explain that part before y'all got to looking at me crazy like i don't know how to do my hair but i promise y'all like it's it's gonna get fixed it's gonna get fixed but that's that's what's going on right now don't don't buy them wig caps no more i'm about to start doing these with no wig cap on there y'all just about to see this hair okay because the wig cap is really unnecessary and it's messing me up and it made me mad that it made my my wig come out the way it did but i'm gonna stop talking before i get to stuttering again now i gotta delete the whole thing nah bye
All right, y'all, we going to our final look. I'm just about to clean it up with this LA Pro Girl Toffee Concealer. I'm about to put that on my part, and I'm also going to drag some down around my edges just so I can, you know, make my little faux scalp, make it look like scalp, make everything blend nicely and correctly. You feel me? Um, but all in all, I would give this wig a probably 7.5, 8 out of 10. Um, as y'all see in the beginning, I did show y'all a couple inches that I did have to cut off the bottom because it really did get super frizzy at the bottom just by me plucking it. And I'm trying to pluck it and then comb it and it was just tangling all up in my comb so it was a lot of shedding and a lot of tangling before i even put the wig on and so beware that part and of course i told you on the sides the um side part for some reason got a different color lace on the side don't know why that's there it doesn't didn't look like i can cut it out so yeah beware of that as well um this is a 13 by 6 if i haven't said that before so it is a lot of parting space that's what i do like about it and then the density i love the density of this wig as well like you know a lot of um synthetic wigs especially the longer ones always be like a like thick and bulky but this one is not thick it's still like you see how it's like giving me scalp it's going it's laying real flat when i put the hot comb on and everything so i really love the density on this wig i'm probably still gonna cut some more you know once it starts getting old and stuff like that that you know that's what you do in long wigs you just go ahead and cut that thing when it get when it get frizzy okay so yep this is the final look y'all know i'm about to go in and put that elastic band on for the final touches and put some lashes on but yeah get this wig if y'all want to i got this one off of amazon um but i also seen this you know on you know all the other places i was about to say some places but i didn't want to shout nobody out for free so yeah that's it you know like comment subscribe you know do what y'all need to do at the end of the videos tell me what wigs y'all want to see tell me what y'all want to see what y'all don't want to see no more if these videos be a little too long for y'all you know whatever but i'll see y'all next week though bye